Alrighty, here I am over at the Roach Palace, and what I'm doing tonight, I'm engaged in more internet connectivity troubleshooting, because from the perspective of the Roach Palace, I can see several open wireless networks, two of them to be exact. Used to be I could only see one, but apparently there's now another. So, what I'm doing over here tonight, I move my laptop up here to the top story. Better mute that stereo before I get kneecapped by a record label. Because you know how they tend to shoot first and ask questions later. Anyway, brought my MacBook up here to the topmost room of the Roach Palace. Now, unfortunately, the two open wireless networks that I found are both connected to Media Bomb's network. Now, the first one that I tried, I don't know where these things are. They can't be very far from here, certainly not more than, you know, several hundred feet away. But anyway, I tried the first one and tried uploading a video and it just bombed out within a couple of minutes time. Got about two or three percent of the way there and that was the last anyone ever heard from it. So now I've connected to the second one and it's been chugging along, kind of ebbing and flowing a little bit, but it hasn't given up yet. Now I hope that maybe I can prove something by this troubleshooting, although I would have liked to have found an open network that wasn't connected to the cable company because that kind of makes it hard to test conclusively and see, you know, is it their problem, is it YouTube's problem? I really don't know where the fault lies. At this point in time, I just want it fixed. So, I've been trying a couple other things. If this video that I'm uploading right now makes it, you'll hear about some of those, and hopefully this video will make it. And if I can get anything beyond that, I'll upload some of the videos that I've made. I've responded to some requests and things like that. If this doesn't work, I'm going to have to go to where my brother College 153, as he's known here on YouTube, lives, and I'm going to have to try his Comcast-based service to see what happens. So stay tuned for more news on this front.